All right, let's go to dash dash setting to find out what is MJ test. So if I put an MJ test, we don't have any of this version. It's a new version. And look at here, it's dash dash test. Occasionally in mid journey, new models are released temporarily for community testing and feedback. So MJ test is for feedback. Now, take a look at these prompts. Imagine vibrant California puppies. And if we put it in MJ test, it's just gonna be the prompt dash dash test is going to be added at the end of our prompt. And this is going to be our result. A general purpose artistic model with good coherency. It's better to put plus dash dash creative with dash dash test so to get better result. If you just put dash dash test, it's just gonna give you a normal image. If you add creative to it, it's gonna be more creative look to it. What if we use MJ test photo? So this is a photographic look to it. If I add this one, it's dash dash test P based on photo. Take a look here. The prompt is the same, but take a look. It has more depth to it. It's more close up. It's much better. Take a look at this one. This, this one before dash dash test and dash dash test P. It's more photorealistic. So if you want to get more realistic image, put dash dash test P or simply put it on MJ test photo to get a better result. Just remember, note on current test models, dash dash test and dash dash test P. Test models only support dash dash a style value between these numbers. I'll be explaining this later. Test models do not support multiple prompts or image prompts. I will explain this later as well. Test models have a maximum aspect ratio of 3x2 or 2x3. Test models only generate two initial grid. It's just going to give you two image, not four, when we use aspect ratio of 1x1. One one. If you use different aspect ratio, not 1x1, one one, just going to give you one image. And remember, words near the front of the prompt may matter more than words near the back. So be careful. This is another sample. I put it on MJ test and I gave it this prompt. Beautiful girl, portrait, and dash dash test, which is the MJ test. Look at the results. Let's use different prompt for MJ test, like this one, Eiffel Tower. And it's more painted look and it gave me half of the Eiffel Tower. So what's going on here? So as we see the MJ test, it works better in portrait images. Now take a look at this one. If we put beautiful girl portrait by Richard Avedon, which is a famous photographer, we get a better result. It's very artistic like 80s and the result is quite inspiring actually look at the lighting look at the depths it's beautiful now let's use the same prompt with mj test photo wow take a look at this one how beautiful and realistic is that so if i'm gonna get very realistic image put it on MJ test photo. And very quickly, I will explain that if you put an artist name and different things in your prompt, you will get a lot better result than what you think. 